We'll stay with the politics because this afternoon, flag bearer of the NPP, Dr. Mahamadou Baumia, is back in the Greater Accra region to continue his campaign tour. He is escalating the campaign to cover uh, three constituencies in the region where he is currently undertaking a number of activities to court the votes of electorates. Addressing a rally of party supporters at the Kanishi market in the Okaikwe South constituency, Dr. Baumia announced a scrapping of import duties on mobile phones if elected. Let's touch base with my colleague Stanley Niblo, who's following the vice president through uh, his tour of the Greater Accra region. Stanley, uh, we've heard or we, we, we've read about Dr. Baumia promising the scrapping of import duties on phone. What other thing has he been telling the market women in particular, which we've been seeing him go about greeting and saying hello to? Okay, so Mawana, this afternoon, Dr. Mahmoud Baumia, who is storing three constituencies, that is the Okankwe Central, Okankwe North, and Okankwe South constituencies in the greater Accra region. Um, he has been engaging some of the traders, as you mentioned, and for him, um, when he, um, the electorate are able to vote for him actively to win power and then come to government or become the president in next year, he's going to ensure that he establishes a bank that will only cater for women in the country. Um, apart from that, he has also been saying that um, agriculture, which used to be the backbone, the number one um, got, um, domestic earner for the country, which is now um, has um, shifted to number three after industries and then um, services sector. Dr. Baumia is saying that agriculture, when he comes, is going to ensure that he pumps in a lot of money and then also reform the way agriculture is being done in the country so that a lot more people can go into it. Um, he has been meeting um, uh, uh, electorates in the, in the district and then he has been sharing mm. aspects of his manifesto that he launched a couple of weeks ago with them. And he believes that the people would actually listen to him and then give him the nod. When he, um, he arrived in the Okankwe South um, constituency in the morning, he started from Seko, which is a part of um, um, Arewaso, uh, Arewaso Central, and then he then proceeded to um, Aveno and then to um, Kanishin, where he currently is in the Okankwe South constituency. Currently, he is engaging some of the constituents in a town hall meeting. Right. Where he listens to them and then he also told them what he will be doing for the country and for the constituency when elected into power 2025. Mama, 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 